Yo, what's Gucci YouTube? It's Rep Lord. I got another fucking pair of sneakers in. Now these are the Air Jordan 1 Top 3s. Surprisingly, I got these from DHgate. Now, I ordered these not knowing and not doing extra research on all these other great websites like Yes Kicks, Shoe Out, Fire Kicks, uh, TonySneakers.com for the Yeezys. All those websites, by the way, I wouldn't link them just... Try to pay attention to what I'm saying and how I'm saying it in the video. And you can type it in in a browser and search it by yourself. But nonetheless, let me shut the fuck up and let get, let's get right into these sneakers. Like I said, these are the top threes. I have tried them on. Um, I believe the price that I ended up paying for these was about $42.33. 42 so the price, you cannot complain. I mean, the quality, let me not lie. For $42, it's a great sneaker. Is it Jordan quality? No. There's a lot of mistakes, as you can see. Let's start off with the peaks. We got a peak here. We got a peak there. The Jordan sign, I wouldn't say that the Jordan sign is necessarily off. Meaning, you know, it's the right size. But I feel like it's not centered. You know what I'm saying? This is not the right placement for the wing logo or the Air Jordan logo on the ones. Um, swoosh is correct. You know, surprisingly, it's actually really fucking good, the swoosh. Now, let's get right into something that's very obvious. Being that these were sent all the way from Hong Kong, China, there was no boxes sent with them. So we got a lot of creases already, as you can see. Big crease over here. You know what I'm saying? Some creases in the actual leather of the other parts of the sneakers. Now this crease, I won't lie. This crease right here was from me putting them on. But a lot of the other creases was were already there. Um, Nike Air, on point, actually. Got the back of it. Let me take out the insole of this this left shoe show you what it's looking like got the nike air here's the bottom let's show the other sneaker let's move this one over now the other sneaker man this shit was creased like a motherfucker on the toe box i'm i'm not sure if you guys can see that pretty dope though i'm not gonna lie for 42 fucking bucks it's actually not a bad cop yo it's not a bad cop. Now, there is more creases on this side of the leather, which I'm pretty sure you guys can see. I'm pretty sure it's picking it up in the camera. We got another widow peak on the toe box here. Two more widow peaks on the back here and here. A couple of stitching flaws around the sneaker all around. But all in out, for 42 fucking bucks, if you rock them a certain way, you can definitely pull these off as the top threes, you know what I'm saying? Now, I'm going to start rocking them. I really just like the colorway of the sneaker, you know what I'm saying? And for 42 fucking bucks, you cannot go wrong. Look at the colorway of this. So, you got the top three, I believe. This is the breads. This is the frags. You got the bottom of the Chicago's, I believe. And in here, you got the Royals. And again, obviously, the breads. And the tongue of the Chicago's, I believe, as well. Oh, the camera's really not even picking that up. Sorry, guys. Cut the tongue of the Chicago. And on the left one, again, Royal, Bread, Chicago, and I believe Frag. So, dope fucking sneaker. The tongues are different colors. Let y'all see that. Dope ass fucking pickup. Um, these right here were $42, like I said. Uh, the DH Gate seller is Fashion Mans. That's F A S H I O N M A N S. He not only has Air Jordan ones, I believe he has 11s. He has 13s. So make sure you go check my nigga Dupo out. That's actually his name when you know you're sending him the money and when you're emailing back and forth with him, talking about the payment. All in all, I laced them the way I wanted them to. You know what I'm saying? I got a fat foot. So I had to lace these in a way that they were very comfortable. And on foot, man, I can't wait for the summertime. And not even the summertime, just 
overall, like, next time I go outside, I'm definitely throwing these on. These are a dope fucking pickup. And um, I really enjoy just seeing the quality of a sneaker because being that I bought these for 42 bucks, and I just recently got the Travis Scott Air Force Ones from Shoe Out, you definitely see that quality. You know what I'm saying? You see that quality a whole lot. But um, I don't want to keep you guys here for too long. This has been the Jordan. Or, this has been the Air Jordan 1 Top 3s. Like I said, the seller is Fashion Man's on DH Gate for about $42. Um, and that's pretty much it. If you like the sneakers, make sure you like the video. Make sure you subscribe if you fuck with your boy. It's been Rep Lordio. I'm about to review some more sneakers. You already fucking know.